Right now, red vulgar graffiti covers a Confederate monument in Woodland Cemetery in West Palm Beach. This comes a week after protests about a Confederate monument turned deadly in Charlottesville, Virginia. And as the mayor of Tallahassee calls for the removal of a Confederate monument on Capitol grounds. News Channel 5's Amy Lipman tells us what the city of West Palm Beach now is doing about this. Amy. Well, Woodlawn Cemetery here is closed now. This gate is locked, but straight down the middle of this cemetery, there is a Confederate monument that is covered in red spray paint. The mayor told me she contacted the city parks and recreation department to get it cleaned up, but that might not happen until tomorrow. The spray paint spells out Antifa, which is a left wing movement short for anti fascist. The graffiti then says expletive Nazi and KKK. Red arrows point at the Confederate flag on the monument and stone pieces from a corner of it are now on the ground next to it. The Daughters of the Confederacy own the 76 year old monument, even though the city of West Palm Beach owns the cemetery. Mayor Jerry Moyo says the city is looking into the vandalism. She says she knows many people are feeling heightened emotions about all of this right now. Moyo says the city took down its own Confederate symbol several years ago, and the city has been in contact with Daughters of the Confederacy recently about getting this one taken down. Reporting live in West Palm Beach, Amy Littman, WPTV News Channel 5.